morning guys. I'm getting ready for Paris today. Yes. It's 5 a.m. and so this is my little travel outfit of the day. I have my Blase Milano blazer on, a little Skims tank, which I'm kind of pretending is a body because the tanks are way more comfortable than the body. I have these Rails jeans. Excuse the mess, I've been frantically packing and getting ready. I literally got back last night from the Maldives. And also my little Chanel pump. So I'm out of breath. Okay, let's go because my car is outside. I thought I was late, Where but then as soon on? as I walk in last night, <laughs> I landed in Vienna. Oh, I thought of you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm with Alex. Good morning. And Fleur. <laughs> and Suze. I thought I was late, and then as I walk in, I'm walking into the Eurostar, I see Suze, and I was like, oh, no. I'm hoping our train isn't delayed. Fingers crossed. The TikTok behind the scenes. Suze's TikTok. We love it. This is what we are working with this morning. Oh my gosh. On the way to Paris. <laughs> Double vlogging me, good morning. Suze, what train are we? Train money. We nailed it, by the way. Because we're me and Susie are next to each other. I'm so excited. We're actually going to Versailles today with the Clay Co team. I've never been to Versailles before and it's always been a mega, mega, mega bucket list moment. And we're actually going to actual Versailles. I've ordered a new hair chain. And Susie's doing it up for me. Thank you, Suze. I quit my job, I work for Amelia. <laughs> I'm her TikToker oh, co-star. Um, <laughs> we did a really good TikTok for yeah, Susie's TikTok. I'm really excited about that one. Oh my god, this is so tricky. Oh my god, yeah, yeah exactly. It's on. We made it to Paris. Bonjour, we oui. got a <laughs> Woo! Our rooms aren't ready yet, which is actually the best gift ever because we can all hang out in the same room. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Should we go and get food? Yeah. Yes. We have picked up Vic and Alex and, uh, well, kind of. And then dropped them off again. <laughs> and left them. We're gonna go walk and get some sushi for lunch. Feed little Sue's, little <laughs> vegan Sue's, not just a carrot. <laughs> I feel like last time we were together, we talked about the one vegan carrot that you oh, get honestly, when you're vegan. It's my running joke, and everyone finds it so funny. But it's only funny because it's so tragically true. It's a vegan, it's a carrot, a single carrot on a plate, or it's a cauliflower cut in half, and they call it a cauliflower steak. Do you know oh what? My gosh. It's cauliflower. Just a cauliflower. Sorry, I'm nothing. Go, 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 go. Do you know go. what? Cauliflower is not filling. It's not. You go to bed hungry if you eat half a cauliflower for dinner. <laughs> That's not okay. That's not okay. Just it's because so I'm easy. vegan doesn't mean I want to be healthy. No. Or skinny. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to eat good food, okay? I want fries. Oh, Susie, give her the fries. <laughs> give the girl what she wants. Josie, <laughs> any any food complaints or requests from you? If someone tells me I'm getting a steak and I get a cauliflower, <laughs> the end. that to me. <laughs> Thank you so much. Wow, we're all ordering the most delicious. Oh, that's for me. Thank you. Oh wow, look at this. This is stunning, though, Sue. You, Sue, you're always so Why are we always I love you. Each other? I love you. I love you. <laughs> just got back from lunch. This is our hotel, the Waldorf Astoria in Versailles. It looks very Versailles, doesn't it? Like it's so stunning and so grand and so French, but then also kind of like a castle. And then tonight we have dinner in legit Versailles. Now that is a turn on, if I've ever seen one. <laughs> Stop it, I can't. Wiggling your camera. Unclip it, unclip it. Oh wow, that section. That is, woo. You could move it wherever you want. I'm not moving, no, I'm not touching you. That's not Excuse me. Someone, Alex Steiner made a joke and was like, made some comment as if like me and Alex were something. And I go to her, yeah, I go to her sometimes, not all the time. We moved it around the back. Yeah. Envision this. Yeah. Back, it would be a bunny rabbit. Oh my god, and then you could hop. You we could make you hop. Look at this room. Oh my gosh, this is stunning. This is where we're having a little brand moment with Clay de Poe. Oh wow, look at all of this. So we integrate these sexual. Sexual. Really suits you, Suze. Sorry about my water bottle coming out of it. Really? That's a 35? You want even bigger? Yeah. Then you can be a broken mom. 
with a with an arm. Yeah. Oh, with an arm. Take her arm. To Carol. Not that she's my mom. <laughs> <laughs> Love you, Carol. Ah, look at this! Wow! Oh my gosh, amazing! A little masterclass. Here I am. Look at this little mini cream. Isn't that cute? 30 and 40 are the two shades I'm going to try. Good evening, guys. Well, it's actually afternoon. I'm getting ready for our gala dinner in Versailles tonight. It's a black tie dinner, which is going to be totally amazing. I've just redone my whole makeup because I wanted to use this one product from Clé de Peau and it's changed my skin. I don't know if you noticed, but because I got back from the flight yesterday, my skin has been so dry today. But look at how much better it looks now. I feel like my makeup has just gone better over the top of it. We just did a masterclass, like a skincare and makeup masterclass. And I love so many of my favorite Clé de Peau products, like the concealer. But hearing about products that I don't normally use was amazing. This was what? I wanted to use this serum, which you put on before all your other skincare and it acts almost like a serum primer in the way that it makes everything go on better and work better. And it's got amazing technology in it. And the moisturizer, the cream, has just finally hydrated my skin because it was just not working for me. I'm ready for like the most glam night of my life. What do you think of this dress? I just got it on Revolve. I'm just gonna do some last minute like gloss to my skin. Um, don't mind me, I'm just down here trying to find my, there we go, supermodel body. Just rub this all over me. Arms, on my titties, here. By the way, if you want your skin to look like glossy AF, this is what you need to use. Both my pins are out. Oh, God. Ah. Outfit of the night, ready for a very, very swanky, swanky gala dinner with Clé de Peau in Versailles. This is the dress, the full glam from Revolve. What do you think? I've got my little shoes on. You can still get these with my discount code, by the way, these Renee's. My little Bulgari bag and skin is finally looking good. Thank you, Clé de Peau. I have these incredible bracelets on, which I bought recently, and my vintage earrings. And I'm gonna go downstairs and try and ask someone to take a picture for me. <laughs> All the girls are downstairs, ready to find the clothes. Big and stunning as Foxy. Where did Susie go? Oh, there she is. She's <laughs> suiting with Alex, and that's so fun. Look how cute they are. We've got to Versailles, and it's about sunset. It looks so beautiful. Got Josie. Hello. Hi. I'm Vic on the other side. Hello. We've got a green, cream, green thing going on. <laughs> Hi girls. <laughs> and Jade is here. Hi Jade. <laughs> and Alex is in the front. My hubs. <laughs> My hubs. <laughs> God, this is crazy. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Wow, look at is Versailles. Being in here, like six YouTubers in here alone, it's kind of crazy, isn't it? Let loose in a palace. Fla is saying this was the king's bedroom. Whose bedroom was it? Oh, right. <laughs> You're gonna, my, sorry. Yeah, I'm like, Fla, tell us everything. I came once before, so I know Oh, that's a... I basically Oh my gosh. Holy shit. Oh my gosh, we are in Versailles. This is crazy, like actual Versailles. Every room is more insane than the last. No, it's really magical. I feel like we're dreaming. Like I feel like we're in some sort of like weird dream film it's or mad. something. Do people need to and get this their is their like a prank. Here? I think Bigger they pardon? Did. I think you would come really? here and then you would get your head shot. What, in the palace? Wow, well, this yeah, is Mary Antoinette's room. This is very immediately Anna home, this room, isn't it? All the florals and pink. I love it. I hear music and violins and all sorts. Wow! Bonjour! I'm up with Alex, I love her so much. Oh my gosh, 
last note to sell. Don't take the stairs at the end of the night. Everyone's like huffing and puffing, taking the stairs. We can do this, we can do anything. <laughs> I love the motivation, Josie. Just got to my room after dinner and there is what's in here. We've got the lotion, that's incredible. I love that, I was really sad when that finished. We've also got the protective fortifying emotion, emulsion. But then I also saw on my bed is the most incredible cream in the whole world. I'm so excited to use it. La creme, the cream. I'm gonna use this right now. Oh, my makeup is off. That was one of the, where's my serum gone? Here it is. I was doing my makeup on the floor. That was one of the most special evenings I've ever, ever had, ever. That was like a core memory evening, you know? We then went to Josie's room and sat around and tried it for like an hour and a half and it's now one in the morning, which is, what time Maldives time? I don't even know. I'm not on a, I'm not on a time zone, you know what I'm saying? Look at this. This is my new cream. Isn't it pretty? Ooh. Wait, there's a little, yeah, here we are. Here we are, peoples. A little sexy spatula. Well, I was actually supposed to warm this up on the palm of my hands. Hold on, let's do that. Let's warm this up. Oh yeah, that's what they said in the masterclass today. I'm getting there nice and hydrating for my horrific plain skin. Pia is meeting me tomorrow in Paris. I'm going to spend a few days in Paris, which I'm so excited about because I haven't actually spent time in Paris in such a long time. I booked so many amazing restaurants while we're here as well, um, including somewhere like one of the most delicious looking places ever with a Wagyu steak and oh. Mm. Anyway, it's Alex's birthday tomorrow, Alex Steiner. Um, so we're all gonna have a birthday breakfast for her tomorrow downstairs. We're gonna meet the girls and have like a nice birthday cake type breakfast. Good morning, guys. <sighs> What day is it today? It's Wednesday today, Wednesday morning. All the girls are going home today, no! But I'm staying until Friday, and Pia's coming today. I had a really good night's sleep, actually. I don't normally sleep well in new beds, but I think I was just so tired <laughs> that I like crashed out. And when I woke up like, shit, I missed breakfast. I didn't miss breakfast. I woke up at the time. I woke up before my alarm. I'm gonna use the essential refining essence to wake up my face. I'm so excited to go and hang out in Paris because I have not hung out in so long. I feel like I said that last night. But there are like vintage stores I want to go to, jewelry stores I want to go to that I love. The French pharmacy. I'm going to use the serum, the incredible clay de Peau serum. We have Sephora in the UK now, so I'm like less excited to go to Sephora. I probably won't even go to Sephora to be honest unless I feel like I'm missing something. <laughs> and the most gorgeous cream, which is a night cream, but Josie told me she uses this in the day and then puts SPF on top. And because my skin is so dry right now, I feel like that's perfect for me because it feels, oh my gosh, it feels like a really lush hotel made bed, but like the face cream version. Do you know what I mean? You know when you get into a really plush bed and you're like, oh, that's what it feels like on my face. It really is like just soothing my skin. Good morning, gang. I haven't actually shown you my outfit. I was actually talking to Vic and Alex when I said gang, but now I'm just gonna show you my outfit in the mirror. And also Vic's jumper, actually more importantly. Ooh, Holland Cooper X Victoria coming soon. I feel like this is so you. I love it, it's so me, it yeah. We do it in like an ivory as well. And I love the one you showed me yesterday with the padded shoulders, the roll neck. The roll neck. That's like a biscuit or a Yeah, bun. oh it's so nice. Oh, I love so that you new. called it biscuit. Yeah. So cute, like I love color, it. Isn't it? Like an oatmeal biscuit. Yeah, That's yummy, I'm hungry. This is Blase Milano. Is you it? love this brand, this brand is so you. I do, no I do love it. Yeah, yeah isn't I love it great? It. Yeah. yeah. Very cute. Wow. Got a little grey tee underneath. Oh. Theory jeans and my little pups. Oh, got the little best, pups, aren't they? Yeah. Should we go to breakfast? Yes. It's Alex Steiner's birthday, so we're gonna go wish happy birthday. Yeah. Alex, make a wish. Oh, just go. <laughs> Be going like, so is that gonna feed me? Yeah. <laughs> it's tiny. Don't need a donut. Make a wish. Thank you. 
Look at which, yes. Uh, it was also in the class. Where's my big cake? Where's Daddy's cake? <laughs> 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 I love your FOMO. <laughs> I mean, who gets worse FOMO, me or you? It's probably you. you. <laughs> no. But me a little bit. Honestly, I get such bad FOMO. Mm. Yeah. You do. I have FOMO of everything. Oh. That time you went to Mr. Village without me. That's you still, were invited. I still lose sleep over it. You didn't want to come. You're playing the whole thing. You're playing the whole thing. Be honest. I've taken your Mrs. Maldives title. Do you have a picture still? Yeah. I get my title back soon. We're doing a picture for Alex's birthday. This is the setup. We've got like all the stuff going on. Everyone's ready to go. Alex is taking the picture. Alex said she wanted to be like the queen and sat down and everyone around her. By the way, I think we should bring a few more flowers in. I just want a quick shot. Give me smiles, give me laughs. We're all so happy. Happy birthday, Alex. <laughs> I have just checked in to the Hoxton in Paris and I'm gonna go and meet Pia. This hotel is like very, very quiet and very peaceful. The rubbish situation at the moment in Paris isn't ideal. There's rubbish everywhere. However, 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 I just saw some rubbish men not on strike and picking it up. So I'm wondering if this afternoon apparently was the day where all the rubbish is gonna be collected. If you don't know what I'm talking about, look at some TikToks because it is crazy. The strikes in Paris right now. She's in Paris. Bonjour, well, you look so pale. Give me I, look, to you. I don't know what has happened. Because I don't normally tan, but like, I'm sorry, I got really tanned in the Maldives. I look like a ghost in comparison. Everyone kept saying that to me, like, you're so tan, you're so tan. I never normally tan, like, naturally. But I this is a natural. Time. No, it is a bit natural. <laughs> it is a bit natural. We're going to go to one of my fave spots en route to dinner. I'm so excited for dinner. It's good. See? It's gonna be so yummy. I hope so. Hannah said it was amazing and Hannah is like top foodie critic vibes. I can't remember what it is, but you sent me the whole It's a spiel. Yeah, sukiyaki te, which basically is like vegetables and meat mm. and noodles in a little situ in like a slow cook pot like thing in front of you. You know when you say new like it doesn't quite get to me when someone says vegetables and blah, Sorry, but the I moment vegetables. you say rice or noodles, noodles. Yeah, yeah. it's like... With wagyu. <laughs> this is like your so new perfect. thing. I know my wagyu. Name is wagyu. That's a terrible new thing to have. Ever, <laughs> I said I was going to start um, caring about food. I used to eat fucking dry pasta and now I'm like, I love wagyu. Dad, do you still eat dry pasta? No, I don't. Yes, you do. <laughs> she sent me a message the other day being like, I'm cooking pasta properly. <laughs> yeah, I was I like, what's water properly? To boil now. Yeah, does it taste it any does better? Taste, it no, does it... taste better. Okay, good. Kind of. So really, I honestly can't <laughs> taste the difference. I slather it in so much butter and cheese anyway. Je parle des fois, tu ne pas. This is where we are going for this night. <laughs> on Hannah's recommendation. I'm so excited. This is the menu. I'm gonna show you the little drawing. Sukiyaki, yeah, here we go. That's what it's like. So it's like a Japanese hot pot with thinly sliced beef, vegetables, onions, mushrooms, and it's in an iron pot and I am so excited. I think you're going to love it. I'm really hyping this I like up. How so you do little, you yeah, that's so yourself. pretty with the little plates. That's so yeah. nice. I don't know, open it. Oh, that's so cute. Do you want wooden or do you want a fancy schmancy? I want fancy schmancy. Let's go for it. Thank you so much. Wow. Thank you so much. That looks amazing. First, I put the fat of the meat. Thank you. Oh, wow. Now everything goes in the bowl with the egg. Delish. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so excited. Best meal of my life. Good morning, good morning. This morning, we're gonna go and walk around the Jardin Tuileries. 
I haven't been there in such a long time and I'm hopeful that like there are some spring things happening in the jardin. This is my little outfit of the day. I've got a something navy three piece on, some Nike shoes and I'm actually wearing one of my favorite bags. This is my bag. Isn't it amazing? I've literally had it for so many years. I feel like the speedy is really coming back and having a moment. You can get them second hand for like a few hundred pounds and I actually prefer the second hand ones because the handles are more worn. Like I've had mine for like 14 years. Is. so the handles are like really really worn and when you buy them new now the handles are like white and I just don't think it looks as nice found the literal only place in Paris that does oat milk and almond milk anyone will know when you come to Paris they literally look at you you ask for an oat milk latte and they say a what <laughs> so got that got a really squidgy little croissant this is where we've come on our walk Jardin isn't it We were just passing the Killian Paris store in Paris, which is so exciting. It's one of my favorite brands, fragrance brands. And this, love don't be shy, is my baby. Pia's wearing Good Girl Gone Bad today. It smells different on you, Good Girl Gone Bad, than me. That's the one what Rihanna loves, Good Girl Gone Bad, I think. Uh, yes, it is. Isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Angel Share is another fave of mine, and Apple Brandy is great on guys. It smells really, really sexy. We have come to the Marais for lunch. I've put on a jumper on top of my um, clothes and then I put on a warmer coat. I literally quickly went to grab it because it was just so windy and cold. But we're going to a place called Cher Genou, my sister said we should go there. Hannah comes to Paris so much because her boyfriend's French, so they come to Paris a lot. So Hannah has like all the best restaurant recommendations and also she used to live here. OGs will remember my vlog with Hannah in Paris. He is gonna love it. Are you loving new foodie me? So lovely. How good. Is foodie very me? Experimental. I'm very yeah. Foodie. Normally I'm like plain salad or sushi <laughs> rolls. No, it's um it's like a Caesar salad fries without the um the sauce, the, without, the without the sauce and <laughs> with the crusty bit like the bread on the side because it's yeah. not gluten free. Yeah. And then some fries on the side of that. Yeah. And then like a water. Yeah. It's just so boring. <laughs> Look, I'm being so adventurous these days. Yeah, you it's are. also Jack. It's Jack and Hannah's influence because I feel like Jack always wants to eat somewhere different. So now I'm like trying to become accustomed Thank you, to Jack. not being a creature of habit. <laughs> <laughs> this restaurant is so cute. It feels really, really fresh. We ordered the dark seagrass and um, grilled goat's cheese. The menu was all in French, so we did our best with me literally sending a picture to Hannah and being like, what's this? What does this mean? This is the vibe out here. It's so cute and it's such a cold day, but the heat is actually working. It feels kind of warm. And this is our little goat cheese starter. That looks so good. Merci, wow, that looks insane. Wow, Pia, that looks amazing. Oh my god. Wow, we've done so well. Look at our stunning meats. <laughs> Holy shiz. This mousse is like unlike anything you've ever tried in your life. This is pure. <laughs> Guys, you do not understand what happened just now. There are protests in Paris at the moment. And there was no Uber, no Bolt, no anything. So we were running so late. So the two of us ran with our suitcases 25 minutes to the train station from Hoxton uphill. <laughs> the sweat patch is on me right now. That was one of the most stressful things. I thought we were gonna miss our train. I was freaking out, thank goodness. We have just made the train because that was no joke. Note to self, don't travel. And there are strikes in Paris. Little mini French pharmacy hall on Briolis Le Cream Concentré because Pia has never tried it. I also got a Nuke lip balm which is somewhere in my bag, like a lip oil. And then I got the classic Sarah Zinc. This is giving me all throwback vibes. Mm, home day. Guys, I like walked into my house and I just wanted to dance. Like, I'm in such a good mood. Was that kind of semi a long journey, but I feel like I haven't been home in two weeks and I'm like, I am a home body. I could honestly not leave my house ever again. I love it so much here. Look how beautiful it is! I just want to tell you. <laughs> 
It's what I need to tell you. <laughs> this is what I do when I get home. I hate bodies because they're like hugging your vagina and the buttons are like pressing into my puss all the time. Anyway, I just want to tell you that if you are in a situation that I was in a couple of years ago where you feel really unsettled, was it a year ago, a year and a half ago, where you feel really unsettled and you're a very environmental person in that your environment affects you mentally and you're living out of boxes or you're just like really unsettled, like I was literally living out of boxes for like nine months. Just know it gets so good and it feels 10 times more amazing when you're actually settled. On that note, I'm gonna run a bath, wash my face, get into bed. I'm gonna be in bed. I'm gonna be in bed at 8.15. I'm gonna be in bed at 8.15. <gasps> I will see you next week with another vlog. I have a really exciting week, actually. Really exciting. So I'll, I'll see you next Sunday. Mwah. Hope you've had a good week, guys. Bye.